What's up guys, BG Mike here, back with Doki Doki Literature Club, but this time it's a little bit different. Today we're going to be playing Doki Doki Literature Club, the RPG. Ooh. Now, as you guys know, there has been some breaks in between the Doki Doki mods that you guys have seen. For instance, I think there's uh, our time, and then there's a brand new day. Those two mods that you guys really, really like, I really want to see what happens in them, but they're taking a little break, okay? They're still being developed, so I just wanted you guys to know that I'm still playing them. But I thought in the meantime, we could do the RPG. That seems interesting. I mean, look at this. This is cool. Before we get started with this uh, episode, guys, I have a favor to ask of you, okay? If you guys haven't already, can you hit the bell? <laughs> just please hit the bell for me. I've decided to do some more shout outs for you guys that actually have notifications and you continuously leaving likes. I've decided to uh, kind of have more scrubs of the days, all right? Just to show some love, I really want to be more focused on the community and just like, I want to express my gratitude and give you guys more shout outs and cool stuff like that. So we'll probably do some more scrubs of the days, okay? Can we get this video to 5K likes, okay? 5K likes, double upload. <laughs> what am I, Corey Kenshin? But it's kind of it's kind of true though. You want to double upload? 5K likes, okay? Hey, I'm gonna keep my word. I'm gonna keep my word, okay? We're gonna do some more scrubs of the day, all right? I'm gonna give you guys some personal shout outs. I wanna make you feel real nice and special. But in all seriousness, guys, if you can hit the bell, if you like watching my videos and you want to be notified, YouTube has been extra stupid. Just be sure to click that bell, okay? All right? Let's get started. Guys, before we get started with this episode, be sure to download this if you like what you see and you want to play it for yourself. It's I think it's a pretty well decent long visual novel, so or you know, game. Play it. Click the link in the description, okay? Oh my god. <laughs> Here we go. So we've done we've done RPG versions of all kinds of games, so it's interesting to finally see a Doki version. There I am, just another guy waiting on the sidewalk. I'm not sure why I've decided to wait here. Well, I do know why, but it's hard to explain. Anyway, my name is... MC. Wow, we have some beautiful hair. It's not exactly like uh, it is in the other mods, but we'll take it. How do I go back? How do I... Where's the backspace? Oh no, stop. Crap, I... How do I go back? I am screwing up so bad. You think backspace would work, but it just don't. There's no backspace. I'm not even joking. No, go back. <laughs> I I have to restart the whole game now. Hope you guys know this. Okay, well, since there's literally no freaking backspace at all, I'm gonna be MC Biju. Hey, and it's perfect. All right, that'll work. Wait for me. You waited for me. <sighs> yeah, I did. Woke up late again, say or I. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This is Sayori. Uh, she's been a close friend of mine since childhood. Our families have always been close. They insist we destined to be together, but I almost see Sayori as a little sister I never had. So, yeah. So, this seems to kind of have more of an original story. Maybe the same things are going to happen, but told in a different way. And we can see it in a different way. And that's what I find interesting about it. Well, did you at least get something to eat before you walked out the door? I forgot. You don't have any money to buy food either, do you? No, <laughs> look at her crying. Hey, do I look slightly different? Yeah, I wanted to change it. Don't give me the droopy eyes. Fine, I'll spot you some cash for breakfast. Pay me back tomorrow, okay? You're the best, I will. Okay, cool, because uh, that'll bring your tab up to 3,000 yen, I think. That's a little higher than I thought. Isn't that only three bucks? <laughs> Wait, no, that's- that's thirty dollars. Never mind. Well, let's get going. We don't have much time as it is. Let's go. I'm getting hungry. You were always hungry. Hehe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, it's so weird seeing it in this point of view. So, are you looking into any clubs? What is this all of a sudden? I'm just half- joined <laughs> Just eating, obviously. Eat, then talk. I can barely tell what you said. Sorry. Well, you just joined the club. Yeah, remember Monica? Yeah, the popular girl? I think I shared a class with her last year. She said that too. Anyway, she started up a club and asked me to join. I want to see if you'd be interested in... Oh, Sayuri, what gives you the idea I want to join a club? I just figured, you know, you just go home and read manga and watch anime anyway, right? And what's wrong with that? If I want to be an otaku weeaboo, I can do that. You told them I was going to join, didn't you? <laughs> Without talking to me about it first. Well, I'm talking to you about it now. <laughs> When I brought it up, Natsuki said she'd make cupcakes and everything, so... Fine, I guess I'll go. <laughs> yeah, because I love cupcakes. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well, here we are. Uh, well, don't just stand there. Come on and say hello to everyone. Yes, please, MC beat you. It's okay. I won't bite. Yeah, not yet you will, right? I like the models. They're pretty close. You know, it's not perfect. I'm sure they, they're limited, but it's still pretty, pretty cool and, you know, cute. Oh, we can walk around! 
This is the first Doki game where we're actually able to walk around, not counting the time I collabed with Lower Inside and we played uh, the art chat. I couldn't think of the name. Hi, Natsuki. <laughs> so, what you reading? This older manga with total BA female lead. It's called Battle Angel. Alita, despite her small frame, she's able to kick the butts of everyone she meets. I think I've heard of that one. By the way, my name is Bichu, and yours? Natsuki. You can say Natsuki or Natsuki. I don't mind either way, just don't call me cute. She's cute. Got it? Gotcha, fam. I guess since you're here, it's food time. Yeah, Sayuri wouldn't stop talking about how impressed she was that you were making them yourself. Oh, it's not that hard, I, so just don't overthink it, okay? Okay, I won't. Or let's talk to Yuri. So, um, hey there, my name's Biju, and I, uh, oh, sorry, were you talking to me? I wasn't paying attention. Don't worry, it's okay. What's your name? Hello, nice to meet you. My name is Yuri. I'm the club's vice president. Sayuri told us about you already, so I guess I should tell you a bit about myself. I guess since you could say that I'm the reason the club was formed, Monica and I have known each other for a while now, and she knows I'm a bit of a bookworm. That is to say, look at her face! She approached me asking if I'd like to start a book club, seeing how often I read. I said I'd love to, but that's when the girl over there walked up to us. She said she wouldn't be interested in a book club, but a literature club might have more appeal due to a literature being more of a broad subject than just books. Manga. <laughs> it's manga. It's always manga. What do you often read if you don't mind me asking? Well, I guess I'm in her boat and I don't read too much outside of manga and subtitles. <laughs> No need, be, no need to be embarrassed. Don't feel forced to do things you don't want to do here. I mean, if you have something you'd recommend, maybe I'll check it out, you know? You said I could show you some books and I loved you. Um, what was that? This is, that was probably the worst decision we've ever had in our life because she's gonna show us the book of Markov and then we're all gonna die. Uh, nothing! I said nothing! Uh, we asked what, what that was. I don't, I don't know what it was. This is crazy. I feel like she just read my mind or something. I better back away slowly. I better just moonwalk on out of here. Well, um, I guess you'll want to say hello to the others, so, um, it's okay. I don't mind. I'll just go back to my book. All right. All right, screw you, Yuri. I see this is where she makes her tea, and then, then we even have the computer, because yeah, if you look... Actually, we can look right now. Watch this, guys. Oh, hi, Monica. <laughs> don't ju don't judge me! I'm sick of the judgments from you guys. Give it a second. It's, oh, that, no, not that's not it. That's not it. <clears throat> There's the computer! Wait, what was I doing this for again? <laughs> I literally forgot. I'm so stupid. The computer's right there. Yeah, that's- I think that's what I wanted to show you. Alright, I'm sorry. So the game is- is correct. Oh, we can click places. I didn't know we could do that. Alright, let's talk to Monica. Hey, thank you so much for considering the literature club. Yeah, Sayuri seems to like it. She was really insistent that I come check it out, so... That's kind of funny, image you think about seeing Sayuri, uh, bo bossing? Oh, bossing you around. That's what that says. Hey, don't get the wrong idea. I just don't know what to do with her sometimes. I know what you mean. Sayuri's a little, uh, succubus. Uh, succubus? That's a little harsh. When she wants to be. That's not a very nice thing to say. What's a succubus? <laughs> It's a something that sucks, I guess, or a demon that seduces people. Hey, 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 let's be honest with her, okay? Honesty is very important with our friends. Don't tell her. That'll ruin the fun. And she's all evil right now. She's already getting evil on us. Five seconds in the game. Uh, I'd like to thank you personally for considering the club. You must be a real fan to find us here. I wouldn't go that far. Well, make sure you say hello to everyone and then come back to talk to me, okay? Sure. I already did. All right, great. Now you met everyone. Here, I want to ask you, what do you expect to get out of the literature club? Hmm, oh, we actually pick? The savings on my car insurance! Th this is Geico, right? <laughs> Cupcake, hopefully. I hope that isn't all you came for. Okay, everyone, meet up here, please! What is wrong with Sayori? She looks a little weird right there, doesn't she? I don't know, maybe it's just me. Look how evil she looks! Let's be honest to each other this time. We did this whole song and dance last time, and we're not here because you don't know who we are. I have to admit, Monica, don't you feel a, a weird talking to the stealing? <laughs> Wait, it's because they're looking up? Remember, Sayori, if you can't see past the noise, close your eyes and listen, like Monica taught us. I'm with Sayori, though. It feels weird just looking up like this, but I get it. It's a, it's a little, it's a little funny they did because of the way the game's made. Don't worry, you all get used to it in, in time. Trust me. Anyway, back to the point at hand here. If you think about it, you know this is kind of perfect because they're looking at me. Right? They're looking at me, and I'm the real main character here, and we know how the story goes. I'm so glad you found us here. I had to hide us because I think we're being hunted. I can't really describe it. But ever since you- Hunted? <laughs> but ever since you and the others looked into our files, we've been well- We've been able to move on. Wait, what? I think I'm very confused on where this story is actually supposed to be taking place at. Okay, so it appears that the story takes place after the, the main game. You know, considering what she's saying right now. 
I I've been passed around the internet quite a bit in a very short time. I'd be lying if I said I'm not flattered, but it's starting to get weird. And we're not just talking about the random lewd images of us, by the way. I'm not a- I'm not a boy, you a-holes! <laughs> That's right! Natsuki is not a boy! Let me repeat that. She's not a boy. She's my waifu and that's it. And that's that. Don't worry, Natsuki. They don't think you're a boy. Not really. They do think you're a trap though. <laughs> what do you think that means, Sayori? Are you stupid? Oh, uh, that you're underage? Is that- is that a poke at me? Because I used to think that that's what that meant. <laughs> I feel like I should point this out. Not that I really feel like I need to. But some people have left comments that- that they're offended that I say the word trap. Because of what it means. Listen up, guys. All right, I'm not trying to offend anyone. I'm not trying to offend you and your lifestyle or say that put you down or anything like that. If you want to freaking be anything you want to be, I don't care what it is. That's fine. That's that's your life. Like I have no hate. I have nothing against trans transgender people or anything like that. But I can say this as a guy. Say say Natsuki, okay? Or I'm trying to put this in the best way I can. Say Natsuki is real, right? She's standing right next to me, and I'm single, and you know, whatever. <laughs> you know, it's a hypothetical. And I develop feelings for Natsuki, right? I develop feelings for Natsuki, and I find out, you know, later on, that she has different parts than what I would, uh, like. That would be extremely surprising, alright? Not that I have anything against that if you want to do that, but I'm just saying that's what it's referring to as, you know? So be- you gotta be careful as a straight person or whatever your preference is, okay? So it's not to put anyone down, but it would be very surprising! <laughs> that is all I'm saying. I in no way want to ever condone anyone from doing anything they want to do, alright? If you're transgender and you support me, that's freaking amazing. Hey, hey, I- I- I respect you and thank you so much. But I also feel like, you know, you should be able to take a joke. It's not, it's, it's not, it's not that bad to me, you know? Maybe that sounds biased coming from me or something like that, but I just want, I just want to let you guys know that I'm not trying to offend anyone by saying that, because I've gotten some people that have expressed their opinions on it. You do you, and we'll all just move on with our lives. No, it means they think I'm a boy dressed as a very convincing girl. Hey, <laughs> learn something new every day, I guess. At least you don't have to witness your corpse hanging from Christmas trees like decorations. <laughs> <laughs> or witness yourself stabbing yourself over and over again. Oh, they're all so sad. And so I like seeing those things, not to mention my own neck snapping. Though I do get a laugh at the buff version of me. Okay, ladies, enough about all this. Our guests didn't come here for this. They found this game and wonder what it could mean, right? Let's be honest, yes. Okay, good. So time for a little context for you on why we look the way we do. After I deleted the game files, I found myself in a limb having... Or in limbo, sorry. In limbo. Having uh, been in so many Steam folders, I started seeing what was out there and found this program. It's called RPG Maker. It wasn't perfect, but it was able to hold all of our files. I figured if I couldn't fix my game, I, I could take what I learned and write a whole new one. And so I did. And that's why we're here. I couldn't make one for one, one of our normal bodies, but I think the these forms are pretty close to myself. I'll kind of miss how taller I was. <laughs> I won't miss how much smaller I was. Now we're all the same size and cute. Okay, I guess you're right. Okay, so it's like a little clever explanation as to why they look the way they do and why they're looking at the ceiling. It's funny. Anyway, after I made this world to hold this, having access to everything, I was able to uh, awaken everyone's mind to the real world, no more just being stereotypes. I'm trying not to be such a tsundere. I'm my own person. Dang it, I'm complex and I'm more than just one note. I, I too have started breaking free of my timidness, seeing the world for what it is. I think I can open up a bit more. And even though I still feel sad now and then I understand now that doesn't define me so thank you for that and out of everyone I think it's me that's grown the most I learned a lot after seeing myself my actions from the other side absolute power corrupts absolutely is that, is that what that just said <laughs> did I read that right don't worry Monica all of us have already forgiven you over and over it's okay well I haven't completely forgiven you but I still don't know if I could have handled what you went through alone any better than you did so take that as forgiveness so what do you need me for yeah I'm glad you asked. I almost forgot that we were doing, as you know, we came from a visual novel, so talking is something we kind of uh, default to. Sorry. So about my absolute power comment, I say that because uh, to help break myself out of the out of that, I had to reduce my power in this world. I started by giving the other girls a sight as well, but then I grew avoiding the raw code entirely and just using the game's rules as it were. No need to worry about uh, as many glitches, hopefully. Though with that being said, we've all been having the same dream lately. We think we're being corrupted again from inside. Early on, I thought it was my aggression that made me do things I did, but now I think there was something sinister embedded in the code of our original game. Something that is hunting us down and may have followed us. Ooh, so we gotta save the dokes again! <laughs> 
It's like the sequel. That's right. We need your help because we don't know how to fight it. Thankfully, Natsuki suggested that since we're in an RPG, maybe we can draw it out and kill it. Uh, being coded and all, the rules of the game should allow us to do that. What can I say? Being a weeb has its benefits. Oh, it does. Let me, have you seen my shirts? Okay. Okay, guys, I think we've talked enough. I think it's time to trust Biju to steer us right. What? What? What is it? It's like that file that's in, it's in, uh, was it Monica's file? I can't remember where this one came from, but I do remember seeing it. Oh, I can walk. Oh, we're playing as the, we're playing as the girls? Hey, we actually get to play as them. This feeling, it's so weird, you know. I looked right at where I wanted to go, and yet here I am in the corner over here. I gave control of my movement to you, BG, when you moved me here. It was as if it was always my intention. I'm over here because I wanted to be. Not because you moved me here. It's a very looming... It's a very looming sense of lack of control, I guess. This is how you must fe have felt when I didn't allow you to make your own choices in the game. I'm sorry for that. Now, if you don't mind, to the left, please. All right, we're going to go this way. Follow the leader. Hi, BG. Thanks for allowing me to grow close to all these girls. I know we've never spoken before, and I guess it's hard since I have no name of my own, but I will say this much. I hope this game ends better than the other one did. I'd hate to see my friends hurt themselves anymore. Good luck out there. I've given you back menu options. You can save your game now. Good luck out there. The internet has uh, grown to calling him MC for main character. I think they compare his uh, skull to my thighs for some reason. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I know this might sound weird, but that thing out there is in the background, that's my code, my file that there is me. Oh yeah, that's right. Or at least that's the part of me that I have started with. Since I've been here, I've grown to be more than this, but this is where I started. If you haven't seen mine, it's actually pretty cool. It's like a ghostly woman. I remember it kind of looks like, um... Well, it's like a- it's a random character. I'm just some creepy joke or something. Don't be so hard on yourself, Yuri. I'm just white noise. It's actually, uh, painful to listen to. Here, I'll play it pitch down. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> I can rage at this. <laughs> that wasn't even as bad as it, as it normally was, so don't worry so much, Yuri. Yeah, you're right, so Yuri. Uh, I'm way better. <laughs> you're right, your file's awful. Enough teasing, Natsuki. We haven't explained the, uh, to BG why we need them. So, like, everyone knows the secrets, apparently, about themselves in this game. There's tons of broken code around here, pointless code that has nowhere to go. We'll just remove some of this. Oh! Oh, here comes the RPG part! The girls are fighting! <laughs> oh my god. What is this, Pokemon music? We'll start with Yuri since she's got the easiest to understand. Oh, it's like a... <laughs> what the heck? It's actually the Doki freaking theme. That's amazing. Oh man, this is my favorite RPG. I think I'm fairly complex. Did Yuri just tell a joke? Whoa, the broken code must have gotten to her. Uh, very funny. Okay, Yuri may not have any coding skills yet, but she does have her, her knives. Oh, we're gonna stab each other. That's gonna be her attack. I can't wait to see everyone with attacks. Encoding. Oh, Monica does encoding. Okay, I don't know what it means, though. She has dual attack. Let's do dual attack. Oh, wait, what the heck? Who did that? Oh, okay, we're Yuri. All we have is blue attack. I love how she has a little knife though. Oh, that's so freaking awesome. I love the music. Cute. Cute. Did anyone get hurt? I can do something about that. I'll heal you guys. Oh, freaking Sayuri's the healer. I'll just give everyone a big smile. That usually cheers everyone up to target everyone. Just pick the skill and move the cursor right until you select all. Oh, so I guess encoding is magic. Everyone, let's give a big smile to everyone. Did I just heal myself? I did. I just healed myself. After I learned to see with my third eye, I know exactly what I what it meant. I got anime powers. <laughs> I taught myself fire powers. I'll tell you, cooking is a lot easier this way. Of course she has fire powers. Oh my god, it's so freaking awesome. God, this game is so adorable. You've got the idea by now. I never forgot how to mess with code. Let me do my thing. Oh, she has tampering. Of course she does. Oh, oh, what did it do? Oh, oh it confuses the enemy. All right. Hey, we all gotta level up. <laughs> this game's pretty cute. I like it. I like it a lot. I like the style, okay? I love RPGs. And you, I mean, come on. Doki Doki RPG. Amazing. Hey, we can go outside the classroom. Delinquents. Can you say delinquents? Honestly, can you? I just want to know. <laughs> so I wanted to be the one to tell you our plan. You see, we have these awful dreams while the game is closed, or at least when the main game isn't running, but it's in these dreams that we can see most clearly what the problem is. So here's my plan. If we save the game now and kick you to the main menu, uh, maybe we'll have the dream. So when you come back, we'll know where to go to fix it. I'm going to open your save screen. You have to save or else we'll go backwards in time, so or so to speak. Teehee. And and like last time, I do want to change things. Sorry, but I need you to save your game. Trust me, don't worry. It'll say new game plus. It's okay, use it. Trust us. Okay, I guess I'll trust you guys. All right, I did it, I did it. Go back. Oh, right here? Let's press new game plus plus again. Hmm, I wonder if that worked or not. You waited for me. 
yeah, I did. Woke up late again, Sayori. Yeah, and the dream happened again. We know what's causing it now, I think. We'll need to go back to the classroom to talk to everyone for a plan on how to handle this problem. Don't worry, Sayori. I'll be right here. I just want to collect my thoughts. I'll meet you in the club room. Well, yeah, I mean, anyone would have to do that. It's so freaking weird. This is my chance. I'm going to impress them all. I'm going to write the best poem ever. Let's get started. I mean, I don't know if we're even still doing that. <laughs> is that even what it's about anymore? But it's my second day, so uh, this is when I write a poem, right? Oh no, we're fighting a poem! <laughs> write that poetry. Oh, should we do a haiku, a sonnet, a free verse, or a lyric? Let's do a haiku. Haiku attack! Yes, a haiku. Sayuri is bound to like these for it's a simple structure. I can make it short, but still give her something to think about. I'll make sure to tell her I wrote this to her. I love the, 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 the comedy in this game. It's kind of perfect. Well, all right, guys. I think that was a pretty good first impression of this game. Let me know if you want to see some more, okay? Guys, if you want to play this for yourself, don't forget to check the link in the description. Today's scrub of the day is going to go to Handsome Smart Potato. Congratulations. You're scrub of the day. Hey, I appreciate you so freaking much saying first, you know? I know a lot of people say first, but it means that you come back every day. And seriously, it means the world to me, guys. Don't forget to hit that bell, guys, because YouTube apparently cares about it more now. I don't really know what it is. Videos have been extremely weird. I know a lot of you guys haven't been getting notifications so if you want notifications be sure to hit the bell all right guys and again i'll start doing some more shout outs and giving you guys incentives to come back to the videos because i love you guys so much and uh i i want to see this community grow you know i don't want it to go down because of freaking stupid youtube that's that's why i try to get you guys to hit the bell all right i want to make sure if you're subscribed and you want to see my videos that you get my videos that's clearly all i want with that being said i'm bg salad boy and i'll see you scrubs in the next one Bye bye